Welcome back to Enslaved Odyssey to the West. Before we continue on and try to... I think we're gonna overload the generator or something to try to get inside of the basically like blast shelter that we think the survivors might be inside of. Before that, I have about 200,000 points to spend. So I don't have anything specific that I want. I think I'm just gonna get a bunch of stuff. So for combat... Let's go ahead and get Wide Attack Upgrade. Increases Stagger Duration of Enemies Hit by the Wide Attack. That's something I do pretty frequently when I'm being attacked by multiple enemies, which is most of the time. Kinda gets them away from me and stuns them for a little bit, gives me some, some time and some space. So, let's grab that. Ooh, it says it'll be staggered for much longer. That sounds good. Uh, do I want any more health? I've already got pr a pretty good amount of health. More health is always better. Should I get the first level of health regen? Yeah, let's do it. Um, yeah, for the staff, let's upgrade the staff a little bit. So I'm not too concerned about the fire rate, really. I would like to be able to hold more ammo. That'd be nice, and the first level is only 10,000. 15 stun, 12 plasma ammo. Okay. Oh, so that's why I was... So the stun and the plasma, they're not combined into some total pool. It's just that the amount you can carry for each one is different. More stun than plasma. Okay. Uh, this one would be pretty nice. Causes stun blasts to explode, affecting multiple enemies with one shot. So if I'm firing into a crowd, that could be very, very nice. Double plasma damage would be pretty freaking cool too, but eh. Let's spend it on something else. Um, shall we go with shield, perhaps? Yeah, let's go with a stronger shield. Yep, now it's twice as strong. Sweet. I think that's pretty good. Yeah, we got a really big shield now. By the way, forever ago, didn't I get a combat ability that I feel like I've never used? Um... I thought... Oh, never mind. I guess the evade attack. I guess I was thinking you'd have to, like, evade behind an enemy and then attack with, with that or something, but... No, that, that has nothing to do with it. What the hell was that? been raised. There's a lever for controlling it there. You can reach it by climbing around. Is there a bonus somewhere around here? Oh, no, we go this way. Oops. Good job. Now use the lever and lower the walkway. I don't understand. Why do the slavers do this, monkey? What do Pyramid want? Right now, let's just focus on getting you to your father. So it looks like I can go off that way, but I think we're supposed to launch him up there. Throw me up to that window. I can make it to the top from there. You'll need to make your own way up. Just hold it together, Trip. 
We're gonna do this. Thanks, monkey. Once we short the power. Okay, just leave him to me. Let's keep going. Hold on, got some points to get. Do you think just like the memory things that Trip can't see? Do you think Trip can't see those orbs either? They're just like, why are you running around all the time? In the corners and stuff, like what are you doing, monkey? I'm chasing down magic orbs. I'm not hallucinating. What are you talking about? There's so much health around here. We need to open the sails and get it moving. Fast. I'll use the dragonfly to show you what we need to do. You should be able to climb up the back. You'll have to pull down each sail to get it turning. Let's go. I should probably remember that I can actually have Trip heal me if I need it. I don't think I've ever used that. I'll stay here and control the brace. straight up. Ah, look at this view. What a beautiful place to live. There's a memory up there too. <laughs> That's so cool, the sails are actually metal. Like, foldable, telescoping metal. So how do I get there? I wonder if I can grab onto it as it goes by and write it down? Probably not. Let's try, though. Nope. Not happening. Oh. 
This looks a little bit dangerous. I guess I'm going to need to have them started up while I'm on it, I guess. Probably. The wind turbine stops in three positions. Okay. <laughs> what a cool ride. Is that the only bonus you get for coming up there? Just a single little thing? I mean, the view is gorgeous, but I expected more. Oh, here we go. I think I have to be on this one specifically. Yeah. So, there, yeah, these pins are actually on all of them. I don't, under I don't understand how this menu works. It's odd. It's very odd. It's hard to explain, but... I don't understand how to activate it. It sometimes activates, sometimes doesn't. Hold it there. Okay, there we go. All right, uh, so we gotta get this one down. So this has to be in the up position, right? Okay, move it. Stop it now. I think I figured out how to use the menu. I thought it would be like... Hold it there. There we go. I, ah, I want to show you the menu thing, but then I'm just going to end up spinning this thing around unnecessarily. It's strange. Just, <laughs> just trust me, it's strange. Okay. Yeah, I think this gets dangerous, more and more dangerous, because it goes faster and faster each time. You see there's like bars. I'm guessing if I hit one of those as I'm going down, I'm probably dead. Ooh. Okay. I'm gonna trigger the power search. Get back to the gate. Ready for when those mechs come through. Uh, no, not quite what I wanted to do. It's surprisingly hard to jump down sometimes. Okay. Here we go.
Yes, it affects groups now. I didn't land. Practicing my hops. I hope this works. It will. The system's powering down. Shit, the dog. Where did that come from? You go ahead. I'll deal with it. Well, if it's anything like the last one, it's gonna be super easy. Oh, it's got a gun. Interesting. Jeez. Sweet, back on this thing! Also, yeah, this fight is exactly as easy as it was before, even with the machine gun. That doesn't even matter. Why why is it so easy?
Uf. Oh, I have no stun left. There we go, got some. So now I can't use my hoverboard. Ah, such a fickle thing. Uh, mostly I want more ammo. But I'll take some more of these things. Nah, I'll leave the single ones. They're not worth that much. Actually, grab something else. Got sixty-two thousand. So there's still the stun charge. That'd be kind of cool. Increase the charge of electricity on the stun charge attack to affect multiple enemies. That could be quite nice. Um, I think I want to be able to hold even more ammo, though. Yeah, let's do that. And increases stun duration of enemies hit by a stun blast. That would also be really nice too. Actually, let's just keep upgrading it with that. We're upgrading staff shooting stuff. Uh, plasma damage I can't afford. That's way too much. Okay, I can't really afford that much more. Could get more stun time. Hmm, yeah, okay. Oh, no, I'm 400 short of that. We can fix that. It worked. Yes. chance you will come back, somehow escape the slavers, and make your way home. So, in case that day comes, I'm recording this message for you. Just to say this, it's a blessing for me at this moment to know you're alive. I love you, Tripp. I said, get me home, I'll set you free. <sighs> I guess I lied. The slavers come from the west, so that's where we're going. I want to find out who did this. And then I'm gonna kill him. Tripp's father has some serious fashion, even in death. Monkey. 
You haven't said anything to me. About what? About how I broke our deal. To let you go. Well, what do you expect me to say? You get home. You find your whole life wiped out. And you want to hit back. I get it. Everything is simple to you, isn't it? It just is what it is. What is this place? It was a factory. Back in the war, they built mechs here. Huge ones. And what are we doing here? Looking for someone. Who? An old friend of my father. This is where he lives. I think he might be able to help us. If he's still alive. This way. I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.